everyone come aboard this ship We don't have to stay in this routine And die from boredom out Leaving friends and parents to their jobs Not to five and schedule full love out Let's take our days and just live them out Hey guys, what's up? It's Monday, April 24th and I'm about to go grocery shopping, so I thought I would bring you guys with me. I also just wanted to share these with you guys. I brought one of these with me and I ate it on the way over here. These bars, they're by no means the healthiest, but they have no dairy, they're gluten-free, and they're soft and chewy, which is what I like in a bar. I don't like the ones that are like really hard. I just, I don't know, I just don't like them. They're called the Whatever Bars from the brand Pamela's, and they're oat chocolate chip and coconut, and this is what the wrapper looks like. I think the box is like $5. I found these at Walmart in the gluten-free section. Like I said, they're not the healthiest thing, but uh, I don't know. I really like them. They're gluten-free and they don't have dairy, which dairy has been really, oops, sorry. Dairy has been really upsetting my stomach lately and it's just not fun. So I'm trying to consume the least dairy products as possible because that situation is just not cool. So, but um, yeah, let's go inside. So I don't know if I mentioned we're at Whole Foods. I haven't been to Whole Foods in a minute. I love buying my groceries here. I usually would go to Target and the gross, the produce was just not as fresh. And I started coming to Whole Foods. Well, like this was years back and it's just like so much fresher. They have organic that's like not super old or anything. So yeah. thinking I might go by Costco to see if they have papayas because these are fairly small even though they're only $169 I feel like I could eat this whole thing in one sitting for like <laughs> one smoothie pretty much so. so I guess I'll show you guys what I have so far um, down here we have the spring mix which I freaking love like this is my favorite oh my god kale I also picked up these real vegetables and I got two little bags of Brussels sprouts I freaking love Brussels sprouts I know like not everybody likes Brussels sprouts but I really do think it depends on how you cook them and I make them roasted um, I'll show you guys one day and they're super good and then <clears throat> I actually came here to look for cauliflower and this is the only one I found I actually wanted two but I'm gonna try to make vegan uh, buffalo wings I think that's what it's called. <laughs> yeah, I think it's a vegan buffalo wings. Um, we tried them at California Pizza Kitchen the other day and I had seen a few people post recipes on them. So I wanna go ahead and try them and see how they come out. And then I got some of these baby carrots. I also got green beans and some portobello mushrooms. I'm probably also gonna get some frozen vegetables because I really love their frozen vegetables. Oh my gosh, I just spotted watermelons. I love their watermelons here. They are seriously the best watermelons I've ever had and I freaking love watermelon. Like I love watermelon so much. I guess I'm gonna have to make room. This is the brand that I get the frozen vegetables in. Um, I think it's just the generic Whole Foods brand. But the corn honestly is my favorite. It tastes so, so good. I like these mixed vegetables as well. I can't remember what else I've tried. Um, I think the edamame, the peas, and I want to say if we had some green beans, but I don't see them. My cart's looking a little full right now. So, oh, here are the green beans. I don't know why I missed them. Right here, these are the ones that I was talking about. Oh, I just get the regular version, not the organic. Even though I probably should get the organic, I just know I really like these. 
And this is another brand I really like. I love their veggie burgers and their black bean burgers. They are so amazing. I really like the ground beef, well like beefless ground beef. I don't know if I'm gonna get any today. I think we have a pack of the black bean burgers at home. I kind of wanted to try the chicken because I seen Mo actually mention them in her snap, I think. I want to say it was these. I'm gonna try those. Crispy tenders. Yeah, I guess I'll try those today. So here's an overview of my cart now. I added quite a few things. So, um, yeah, I got a pack of each of these frozen vegetables. Uh, I got the honeydew, one watermelon. What else did I add? I think this water, yeah, the electrolyte water. I got some vegan mayo. I also got some wing sauce for the cauliflower buffalo wings that I'm gonna make. And then I got this vodka sauce. Never tried this, but I wanna try it with pasta. I got some grape tomatoes, or is that what you actually call these? I don't know, I always call these grape tomatoes. Um, I got some potatoes. Then I got two avocados, and I'm so happy I found some that are ripe because the other ones were like literally rock hard. And then I got these Gardein Plant Protein Crisp Tenders. Um, I think that's how you pronounce that brand. I don't know, but they're crispy tenders that aren't actually chicken. And then I got some asparagus, some black seedless grapes. Oh, I think I showed you guys the mushrooms. I got some bread. And I think that's about it. I think that's all I'm gonna get this trip. So let's go check out. I lied, I'm picking up some coconut chips. I've been meaning to pick some of these up to put in my smoothie bowls. Yo, my cart's looking a heck of wild right now. I was planning on putting them in this side, but this car parked way too close to me. And I guess I parked too close to the line that I really can't get to that side. So I guess I'll have to make it work on this side. <laughs> Got to show you guys well I didn't forget I showed you guys towards the end I got myself a piece of cake and then Octavio loves this tres leches cake from there so I got him like four pieces and I also forgot to show you guys I got some zucchini noodles which we also really like I remember towards the end when I was putting them onto the checkout but this cake tends to spill sometimes, so I just really hope it does not. Especially with my driving. Ooh, Lord knows. I don't know, hopefully the watermelon doesn't squash them. I might just bring this bag up there because honestly I'm so scared for the tres leches to come out and it makes a mess. This bag is just gonna have to ride shotgun. I forgot I left the keys in here. <laughs> So get the only thing you car back. Don't be one of those lazy people. I'm so thirsty. Luckily, I brought two bottles of water with me. One of them is nearly empty. It's so hot out there. It's like steaming hot. I don't even know how hot it is. I'm put the keys in. Let's see how hot it is. 70, it does not feel 77. It feels like 100, seriously. And my face is probably all red. Y'all, it's hella hot out there. Like, the truck says 77, but I think it's lying. So hot. Ugh, I don't know what happened there. I just get like all red on my chest area whenever it's hot. When I'm like moving a lot, or I don't know, it just randomly gets hot. I mean, randomly gets red, what? Wow, this is what I looked like when I was coming with my groceries. all those bags in one of those tiny cars i need to remember to get the larger car and not have to struggle with the little car because i always feel like i'm gonna get a little bit of groceries and i end up with like a car full um i actually didn't think it was that bad um i got like a bunch of food and it was only a hundred dollars and i feel like usually every time i come here i get like a bunch of food 
and it's always like a crazy amount of money but today it wasn't maybe because i didn't actually get any meat or anything like that oh i should have got some shrimp i love their shrimp oh darn i don't know if i should go back i feel like i have enough food for the week like this combined with like what we already have at home i feel like we could make it through the week I hadn't been grocery shopping in so long. Like it's been a minute. Like we usually buy um, like our drinks, junk food or whatever snacks for us, um, like at the house. But like the majority of the food, his mom goes out and buys. Usually both of us head to Walmart together and I don't know, she kind of just asks me and see what I think we should make for the week or what we should take home or whatever. But like she usually does the majority of the shopping and I don't know I miss it I feel like it's very therapeutic for me like especially when I come during the day I mean it's 1 52 so it's nearly 2 but like when I come during the day I feel like the stores and like everything in general is a little bit more calm than like in the afternoons in the afternoons I feel like if I go to the store I get a little bit of anxiety like I rather go during the day or at night like whenever it's like calm calm so yeah like i really missed it i forgot like what it felt like i will have to head home because there's probably a lot of traffic already um heading home and try to get home so i can uh start cooking dinner because i'm hungry actually i just had that um whenever whoop, whenever bar on the way over here and that's pretty much all i had for breakfast um, I was supposed to go to the Chevy dealer today, but I ended up calling them and canceling. Like, I honestly, when I have something like that, like, adultish to do, even though that's, like, not an adultish, it's, like, everybody has to go do their stuff for their vehicle. But, like, it was, like, giving me anxiety in a way. Like, I just was like having not nightmares but I couldn't sleep last night I was tossing and turning and then this morning it was like around 7 whenever uh, my boyfriend's sister um, the girl that was in a few vlogs back we were at Home Depot together um, she was leaving the house and it was 7 and I like opened my eyes and I seen that it was like bright out I was like oh my god I slept through my alarms and I picked up the phone and it was like 7.05 or something crazy and I was like oh like, it, it, I was just, like, freaking out. Like, if I have appointments, it's kind of, like... Like, it gives me anxiety, and, like, I just can't sleep. And, like, I have... Like, if it's, like, a dentist appointment, then I have, like, nightmares about it. Like, that it's gonna go wrong. Or, like, I don't know. It's... I just have issues. I will accept it. Hopefully my glasses aren't too distracting with all the reflection thing that it's doing oh man i seen somebody with their reusable bags i forgot about mine i don't even know if i have any with me here i would always forget them regardless like i could have them in the truck and i would just get off and go either way i really like those um paper bags they give i totally reuse them all the time so yeah let's head back home um i don't know if i'll show you guys of me making the buffalo bites. Oh, I'm just gonna be following somebody else's recipe, so this is definitely not gonna be my recipe. This is gonna be my first time making it. Maybe like after I get like pro status, I will show you guys how I make them. But um, I'm pretty sure you can just like look it up, Google it. Oh, sorry. I'm pretty sure you could just like look it up on YouTube and the recipe comes up. If you like cooking, do you get like addicted to watching cooking videos on YouTube? I do. Like I can sit there all day and watch cooking videos and like just kind of try to get ideas or like find recipes that I might want to try or whatnot um, I could do that like all day I freaking love cooking but sometimes actually sometimes I get lazy but I hate the cleanup I hate I think that's like with everybody I hate the cleanup process I hate washing dishes I hate cleaning after like 20,000 pots and pans and stuff I need to learn to do those one pot wonder recipe things yeah, I think I'm gonna head home and I'll see you guys there. I'm not sure if I'm gonna vlog anymore. Octavia is at work right now, so chances are I'm probably just gonna get home um, and put the groceries up and start cooking or something because honestly, I'm a little hungry and I'm anxious to see how that's gonna come out. This might just be a go to the grocery store with me. And if it is, um, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. And y'all let me know if y'all like this video, by the way. Um, I just kind of thought I would do this. Nothing exciting. Everybody goes buys groceries. But um, I just thought I'd show you guys what I picked up today or like 
some of my favorite products from here and I should probably head out because the frozen vegetables and the cake and stuff needs to be in the fridge so I will see y'all in the next video peace out